So welcome back, everyone. Woohoo! We've got Michael. We've got Michael Henderson here. He is the owner of Tapestry Insurance Group. We're live on Facebook. We've been live the whole time, but on those 15 minutes it takes, I forget to even say it. But we yeah. are live on Facebook. We're Michael here. Henderson is in the house. Tell everybody a little bit about yourself. Today you said we're going to talk about Medicare 101. Yes. So, well, we do Medicare. We help people interpret the Medicare maze um, when they become eligible. So, um, you know, we, we cover the whole Southwest and, and we haven't talked about the basics of Medicare for a while. So maybe what we'll are the today. basics yeah. of um, Medicare? You know, um, Medicare, when you get the card from from Medicare, from the government, original Medicare, there's part A and part B. Um, part A is your hospital. Okay, and you're going to get that automatically when you turn 65, or if you've been disabled for 24 months. Um, that, if you've if you've paid into Medicare through working your life, that's going to come automatically to you. Part B is your doctor's office, all your outpatient stuff. That is going to be something that you it's optional. You don't have to take it. So, for instance, people that are aren't retiring yet, you know, if they're still working at a at a large company or somebody that has employer group benefits, they may not take Medicare Part B yet because there is a small cost to it. It's $148 a month now for this year. Right. People think Medicare is free. Yep. And it's not. You paid into it. You paid in. You get a great discount. Part A is, is zero, but your Part B comes with a small cost. Right. Um, but then Medicare is basically an old school 80-20 plan. People think that once they get Medicare, oh, I'm covered. And you're covered decently, but it's not great. Um, it's an 80-20 plan after deductibles. So what we do is help people navigate that, figure out what, you know, what's the best course of action if they need some additional coverages. Many of the coverages don't even have a premium attached to them. So there's some great additional coverages that we help people with. What I love about Michael is that you truly are the seniors advocate. You we do. take everyone's phone call personally. And even though you you help you have um, agents that help mm -hmm. throughout the entire Southwest, yep. you like to talk to everyone individually yourself first to find out a little bit about you. And and you know what? That's what all of this is about. First, too, is finding out a little bit about them, and then you help them find out what the right person for their area would be. Because each individual, there's so many, and I, you can tell them yeah. how many are there. Like in each individual county, there's so much there's to know. Tons of options. You know, here in Maricopa County, we have. 57 or so odd different Medicare Advantage plans, just the Advantage plans. Then there's prescription drug plans, there's supplements, all, all in addition to that. So there's lots of confusing information out there. Um, and unfortunately, when somebody is turning 65, starting about a you know six months to a year out, they start getting mail like crazy. I don't know. I'm Trixie too, and I'm getting it. <laughs> I don't, they think it. I'm yeah. 65. People, people, they, and it's not uncommon to walk into somebody's home and you'll see, a, a if they saved it, you'll see a foot-high stack of mail on their right. countertop. Just Medicare information. Um, all the insurance carriers, you know, um, medi they're getting stuff from the government. They're getting advertisements, and it just adds up. And it's very On television confusing. everywhere. It's all there. And it is and that's not to mention the television. We're yeah. going to talk about that in a minute because <laughs> I want you to know Joe Namath doesn't call back and talk to you, he right? He won't answer your calls. He doesn't answer your calls. <laughs> uh, but we want people to understand to something else. First of all, this is a free service to you out there, right? Yes, that's important. We actually get paid for our time from the carriers. We represent most of the carriers um, in, in the states we are in. And when you pick a plan to go with, we're reimbursed from the carrier. So we are able to pay our bills, but our clients aren't paying them. Right. You know, so. And so for you, you're getting great information to arm you with good information with uh, so that you can make good decisions. Yep. I think that's what this is all about too, is understanding what your needs are. And, uh, you know, when it comes to medicine and I, I know us old folks, you know, we have a few medicines that we're taking everybody. and everybody, and you can even be on, let's say insulin. We you talked mm -hmm. about this before. Insulin has a jillion different types of, of names. That, so everything is different. You can't do it on your own. Yeah, there's, you know, when we when we compare prescription drug plans for somebody, um, we we take all the data, we take their prescriptions, we take the amounts that they're they're supposed to take, and we we look at all the different plans to see what plan is going to cover those at the best rates, right? And um, 
And then if they're looking at advantage plans, we make sure that they're doctors or doctors that they want. We're looking to see if they're in network. So there's a lot of comparisons that go into it. Not to mention just filtering through the, all the plans, right? right. There's just, tons of them. Yeah, you don't even <laughs> want to bother. So have somebody else that's going to do this for you. It's a free consultation. Also, we want you to understand, too, when, you, when I give out this phone number and you call him, please leave a message. This is leave something else. Yeah, if, um, Medicare is very highly governed to eliminate predatory practices um, against seniors, which is a good thing. The, the downside is, is when somebody calls and doesn't leave a message, I can't call them back without a permission to call. So call me, leave a message. Plus, I do get a lot of phone calls. I'm with people a lot of times. So leave a message. I'll call you back. And the phone number is 602-541-7656. Toll free. It's 800-506-8810. He does service the entire Southwest. This is a free uh, service to you, the families. You can also check him out on Tapestry Insurance Group. Dot com. Uh, over the weekend, uh, Friday, you had that uh, event. We did your first outside event yeah. that you hadn't had one for a year. How was it? First event in over a year. Woohoo! Wow. <laughs> yeah, it was at Sun City West. We had a great turnout. We had, there was a little car show out there and a merchant event. We um, at our offices, we we you know do free service like laminating people's Medicare cards and things like that. And um, we had a lot of people come by and and talk to us. You know, and it's all about information. We didn't sell anybody any any insurance or anything like that. It was all about information, and just like we do every day, uh, we did give away ice cream bars. But you know, oh, that was a good thing to do. Um, and I love the idea of, of laminating the cards because yep. now everybody gets these cards, and you put them in your wallet, and they become all I don't know. It's crazy the way they look. It's like here's thing. my here's my ID, and it looks terrible. Yeah. I'm not a derelict, I promise. But, you know. but anyway, um, so great idea. Uh, and I now I lost my train of thought of what I was going to say. But also for you, what you you do is you make a complicated subject easy and also fun that's something that you're we, all about yeah we try you know it's 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 very it's confusing it's it's a big deal for people you know when we look at at insurance for the most part people haven't really chosen a medical insurance during their lifetimes if they've worked for a company they just pick what's available from that company maybe one or two plans available they base that on the cost that's coming out of their paycheck right I mean we all have done it um, when they get into Medicare, this is the first time they're getting all this information and, they, and they've never waded through it before. So not only is Medicare confusing, but if you haven't had any experience with just health insurance to begin with, it's even worse. <laughs> and I tell you right now, and I, he's probably listening, but my ex-husband, <laughs> if he th th thinks he could do everything, sure. right? Hey, and I know I can do, just, yeah. right? And I go up on Google, Dr. Google, and I can figure it out myself. No. He did not, wasn't able to do that. And uh, I was listening to him one day talk, a bunch of old people were sitting around a table talking about me they're, that they're going to turn Medicare, uh, they're going to get their yeah. cards soon. They were all excited about it. Mm -hmm. And I simply said, you know, you might want to make sure that you talk to somebody. Don't just ask this guy because, you know, he is not the same as you, yep. even in your own family. Yeah, and, and that's the beautiful thing about Medicare. You know, again, we're used to plans where husband and wife have to be on the same plan if it's from an employer or something like that. With Medicare, we get to tailor the plan to the individual. So somebody that has diabetes is going to be on a different plan than somebody that only sees the doctor once a year for their checkups or mm -hmm. something like that. And mm -hmm. so we're going to tailor fit that. Even if you're in the same household, husband and wife, whatever it might be, we're going to make sure that you each are on the plan that fits for you. It just makes sense to give him a call. It's a free consultation. Leave a message because if you don't leave a message, he can't call you back. That's just the rules of Medicare. <laughs> rules of engagement. And so the phone number to call is 602-541-7656. Toll free, 800-506-8810. He services the entire Southwest. He, this is a free consultation to you. He is your senior advocate. Let me say this. It's a Medicare day every day. Any day is a Medicare day. Yep. Any day. And someone yep. turns 65 every day of the year. Every day. How Multiple many? People. Multiple Over people. Over 4,000 a month here in northern Arizona. So we're going to go to a break. Hi to everybody out there. Woohoo! We've got Michael Henderson in the house here. And we're going to go to break. When we come back, we're going to talk further. Because you know what? People need to understand Medicare 101. Yeah.
Hang tight. We'll be more. back in just a minute. We should be done now. That was that, that was, was it. so much fun. That was so it. Now we're, we're going to keep on going because we're still live on Facebook, and so we're just going to talk a little bit more here. Um, when you work with your clients, you know, sometimes you have stories that you like to tell us. Is there anybody in the le recently, with, with, especially with COVID, you know, and that's the question. Has, does anyone have a question of, well, you know, um, I had COVID. Mm -hmm. Can I still get Medicare? I mean, does things mm -hmm. like that have sure. a, ha what kind of questions do you get asked about that? Yeah, we always get asked about pre-existing conditions, you know, if that impacts getting onto a plan and, but, um, and it depends on what we're talking about, but in general, Advantage plans don't have medical questions at all. And a supplement, only the medical questions only pertain if um, if it's at six months after your Medicare effective date. So, and prior to that six month date, it's guaranteed issue on a supplement as well. So. Right now, with uh, it, you know, I know that you have seasons, right? And there's uh, different uh, time periods uh -huh. within those seasons yep. that they can do certain things right now is there anything that they can do or should do before a certain amount of time or do they have a little time now before the next enrollment session or where they can change plans or anything like that well there are enrollment um like enrollment guidelines so annual enrollment is october 15th through december 7th um after january 1st starts open enrollment which is january 1st through march 31st so we still have that yeah, we're not allowed to advertise that, but it is, it, is, that. it is an enrollment period. And then the rest of the year, it's um, it's uh, special elections. So if somebody moves here from out of state um, or another county, um, somebody that's low income has a special election period. Uh -huh. There's lots of different election periods. Oh, if they lose their group coverage, let's say somebody's retiring. In right, the a lot of people. And they're, yeah, you know, There's um, always a reason to call. There's there somebody's is. moving in. That's why any day is a Medicare day. Any day. Even though Medicare season is, quote unquote, They October always think that it's just in October, but yeah. it's really not. Yeah, it's not. It's, we do 60% of our enrollments the rest of the year. Are we back on? What? I didn't know if we were going back on. You put your headset on. Yes. <laughs> you fooled me. I thought I had to be ready. <laughs> They're talking about pee pee problems. Oh, what? <laughs> what is it? Incontinence. Oh. <laughs> but I hear what they're saying. All right. We've got more to talk about. We could let, we're, and we're also, you know, if in, if there's somebody that's licensed or, or that wants to, that has the desire to help people, you know, we always are looking to bring on agents that are. Um, excited about the community that want to help the community that's what we're all about so Ted Watkins Ted. listen to that review that's amazing <laughs> we're back welcome back <laughs> Michael Henderson in the house. Woohoo! And you know, Michael loves to make things fun, and uh, Medicare is a, a question that people always have. And it's nice to have somebody like you that can, as experienced, that can help people through this, I guess, maze if you want to talk about it, because there's yeah. a lot of different things you need to know about. Um, Michael, it's all he, about Medicare. And, but uh, there's a lot of questions with mm -hmm. that. He services the entire Southwest. He is your seniors advocate, and he, I, he helps people, and he loves what he does. That is what I know for sure, and you're all about service. Yep, this is... Uh fell in love with this this industry after my very first appointment which I told you that story on a few shows ago but uh, it's it's something that we you got to love helping people right and you got to love helping the community and and that's that is the joy from it uh, we get to pay our bills as a as a sideline of course which is we have to do that to stay alive but we are able to help the community in ways that is so needed it's very underserved it's it is it's amazing how many people don't understand medicare um, that uh, 
that need help with it. It's just amazing, and it's so much fun to help. So, yeah. so when they call you, please leave a message. Let's understand that uh, if you don't leave a message, he can't call you back. And uh, phone number is 602-541-7656. Toll free, it's 800 800- Five zero six eight eight one zero. One question that we were asking, and I want you to be able to talk about it mm-hmm. as long as I can. <laughs> um, oh, oh, but, but we were talking during the break because we do talk with Facebook uh, while, while we're on the break because we're live to here. Uh, so what I asked you is, did you get a lot of? Do you get a lot of questions with people with this COVID that now some people might have had it? Uh, people are fearful of that that maybe they won't get covered. Yeah, you know we. Um we get questions like that all the time, but yes, people are fearful of one if if you know they had COVID and and now they they're trying to get under Medicare. Maybe they're aging in in the next couple of months or something like that. Is that going to impact it? Because everybody always hears about medical questions in in insurance, and uh, so we get that. We also get uh, is you know if COVID stuff is covered on Medicare and that kind of thing. But yeah, so when you're going on to Medicare. An advantage, in an advantage plan, there's no medical questions. So you could be in the middle of cancer treatments or something like that. There's no medical questions. And every year when you change during that annual enrollment period we talked about, October 15th through December 7th, you could change advantage plans and there's no, no questions either. Medicare supplements, a little bit different. The first six months that you go on to Medicare, you have what's called guaranteed issue. There's no medical questions in the first six months of being on Medicare for a Medicare supplement. After six months, there there can be medical questions on a Medicare supplement. So that you know, if they specifically wanted a, med, a Medicare supplement, that may be an issue. If they've been on right Medicare, there, that's confusing. It is confusing, right? right? Yeah. And that's why you need and, to talk to Michael. And it's not, and and it's hard to explain in a in a thirty minute segment on the radio because there's different scenarios. There. They may have guaranteed issue even on a supplement, but there's specific scenarios. And that's where you come in. Yeah. That's where you look into. Everybody has a story. I think that's another thing, too. Each each, that you're each individual. Every situation is different. You know, you're retiring from your group and. from employer group insurance maybe you're retiring and and just ready to ready to you know go have some fun go golf or whatever you got to look at that medicare option you got to look at what you're going to need to keep that coverage a lot of people uh, again don't understand it because they've never had to really look into medical insurance and some people even have lost their jobs i mean that's kind of scary too yeah right because especially during covid sure we've got a lot of um 65 and over folks that were still working when COVID started and they, you know, they got furloughed, laid off, whatever, because of COVID. And they just said, heck with it. I'm just going to go ahead and retire a little bit before I thought I was going mm-hmm. to. So we've seen an influx of people going on to Medicare that weren't planning on it necessarily, but it's, uh, it's time to do it. <laughs> and like we said earlier today, every day is a Medicare day. Every and day. it's great to get yourself, especially if you're just going to be turning 65 yep. you need to make sure that you do this in advance don't wait and don't procrastinate which we all know you do yeah you know um, we can start working on a lot of these plans we can actually do an enrollment for uh, 90 days out from a Medicare effective date so if somebody's if you know effective date is you know the first of, of July or something like that we can we can start doing their enrollment stuff for a plan 90 days before that. So, and their Medicare card will usually come. Now, not always. We're dealing with the government and we're dealing with mail and all that stuff. But usually they'll see their card come in about that 90-day period as well, their red, white, and blue Medicare card. So they want to keep an eye out for that. And again, it's that flimsy paper card like, Well, you know, you know what? If you want it laminated... <laughs> Come to the office. Come to the office. He'll, he'll laminate it for you. Yeah. Some of the things that you also do that people, you know, when you don't think about, I think people are worried about uh, their doctors. Yep. Are there doctors in network? And that's one thing we check out, you know, along with things like their prescriptions, like we talked about earlier. Um, on an Advantage plan, those are network-based, just like your employer group plan. They're PPOs or HMOs, and those have doctor networks. Um, the, they're very comprehensive here in Maricopa County. Um, but we do want to check and make sure that the plan you're choosing or the plan you like has your doctors or doctors that you want in the plan. So we look all that up. We help navigate that as well. Um, if your doctor, uh, your primary care doctor wants you to see a specialist, you know, we want to make sure we help to make sure that doctor's in network as well. Yeah. So we, we work with all that, that 
umbrella of stuff. I mean, there's so much. There just is so <laughs> much. You can go on and on. So, uh, but he does help and service the entire Southwest. And what he likes to do is uh, he likes to make sure he talks to every single person. So yep. even if he doesn't answer the phone because he might be busy, he does call everybody back, leave a message because those are the rules in Medicare. If you don't leave a message, he can't call you back. Yeah, when, and you know what? We talked about election periods a little bit, and I don't know if we talked about this on the first half, but there's a lot of people moving into Arizona right now. And if you're 65 and over moving into Arizona, we need to talk because your plan that you had in another state may or may not be the best one for here. The rates may change if you're on a supplement, um, but if you're on an Advantage plan in another state, we need to change it to an Arizona one for you. Things like that too, and that's an election period. We can do that any time of the year. Mm -hmm. If you move, if you move this month, we can do it mm -hmm. now. So. Well, let me just tell you this. I say this a lot on my show, and I think my phone's going off here. Uh, but honestly, this is what I say, and I know when I say it, it, it sounds kind of, kind of like I'm patting myself on my back. But <laughs> I love my show because yeah. of the information that it gives for everybody out there. Show. Thank you, <laughs> and. You know what, also to the people that listen that are out of state, right, that they have mm -hmm. their parents that are moving here, they can call you and say, hey, my mom is moving into the uh, southwest area, yeah. and they can talk to you. And this is important information for people out there. And why do people come back? Well, first of all, because they like me, but, no. <laughs> but really because... It gives you that opportunity to be able to reach out people that can hear out. you yeah. and get that information out there. That's part of that that community service that, that I talked about that we like to do. You know, it's for me, it's about getting the information out there. We want you to call us with your questions about Medicare. More than that, I want you to be educated so at least you know that you have choices. You know, if, you, if you've talked to somebody out there that, that may only represent one carrier or something like that, I just want you to know you have choices so you don't have to feel stuck. And that, if I if I accomplish that on the radio, that's that's fine. You know, it's about community service. It's about getting the information out there. So give him a call. His phone number is 602-541-7656, toll-free 800-506-8810. And his website is tapestryinsurancegroup.com. This is a free service to you out there. Um, when we talked a little bit about people who ask other people and you know, mm -hmm. it's very important, I think there's, that's where a lot of people make a big mistake. Well, you know, we all, we all trust our friends and neighbors um, and, and that there's nothing wrong with that. You know, your friend or your neighbor or family member may be on a specific plan, but that may be for a reason. Maybe they have a condition that, they have, that they're on that plan or um, their, their prescriptions, maybe they're on a long list of prescriptions or a very short list and you're on a long list, you know. So we want to tailor it again to the person. Remember, there's lots of plans out there, 57 or more here in Maricopa County alone. So, Is it a good idea for people who, let's say, are sitting here thinking, gosh, I wonder if I have the right plan. Mm -hmm. Can they call you and talk to you and say, hey, this is what I have, and you could say to them, well, you this was good or this yep. wasn't, and maybe, I don't know if you could change it now, but maybe for the for going forward, how does that work? There's never a bad time to call. So we just had this happen with one of the agents actually here in, in Maricopa County last it's week. Amazing and what I can what, find. Look at that question. Amazing. And um, um, this agent, she she called me and she said, hey, I have a client that's, that's this, this, and this. And turns out we couldn't change it right now because they didn't have a valid election period for their situation. But that person now knows that there, there is a better plan that they, than, than what they're on now, and they can change during annual enrollment coming up. Now, that could have just as easy, easily have been that they had an election period, so there's no better time to call than the present, because worst case scenario, we have to put it off for a few months. Maybe not. But guess what? When you see that there's like, oh my God, I will be paying less money, yeah. that's awesome, and that's where they come in. He services the entire Southwest. What are your final words to everybody out there? Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I love Michael Henderson. He's so much fun, and he makes a complicated uh, subject. Not only does he make it more understandable for everybody out there, 
but he also makes it a lot of fun. Let's so give this. him a call. His phone number is 602-541-7656. He services the entire Southwest. Leave a message because he can't call you back if he, if you don't. That toll-free number is 800-506-8810. This is a free service to you, the, the people out there. And his website is tapestryinsurancegroup.com. Woohoo! Woo Have a good one.